Fantastic news for laptop users. They have finally created a model with a 100-inch screen. Even though it's only a virtual laptop, you can watch amusing cat videos and have comfortable conversations with your friends while working as no one can see you. It has a 256 gigabytes internal drive, a Snapdragon 865 processor, and 8 gigabytes of RAM. The laptop costs about $2,000, weighs only 1.5 kilograms, and runs on Android. Additionally, the organization will give prescription glasses if necessary, so don't worry if your vision isn't flawless. Why would someone feel the urge to build a robotic sixth finger? A French-Japanese team has its own response to this question. This advancement could prove beneficial in the development of prosthetics. The team is specifically researching how this improvement affects the brain. If test takers believe the robotic finger to be a part of their own body, which area of the brain engages in this process? These investigations could potentially lead to the creation of prosthetic body parts that are compatible with lightweight clothing in the future. Why not, then? Some IT professionals may eventually desire additional fingers to complement their excellent laptops. The United States might use these drones to deliver replacement fingers. Built to carry loads up to 7 kilograms, the XP4 variant can travel up to 111 kilometers per hour. And that's only the cruising speed, not even the top speed. Additionally, the drone can take off and land vertically because the wings fold. The U.S. Navy is currently testing one of the prototypes, making the design superior to the competition because it can scale up to carry five passengers. This is a recent advancement in creating amazing photos. You can use it in a flying taxi or bring it along on outdoor excursions. Its primary function is to shield the camera from falls, to put it briefly. You can move around with confidence and find the ideal angle because to the platform's comfortable rifle shape. Additionally, the platform has room for microphones, spotlights, and other accessories. The yellow lever changes shooting modes and the trigger controls the shutter. It will increase the weight by 800 grams, but it's preferable to have a little extra weight than to risk breaking your camera. On Indiegogo, we are awaiting additional information and prices. The fashion industry has also seen some amazing developments. Consider clothing that makes use of neurotechnology. One of the earliest brain computer interfaces in history, with 1,024 channels and color changes in response to brain waves, transmits the data. The dress's resemblance to the scales of a pangolin led to its naming. The basic idea is straightforward. The garment lights brighter the more active your brain waves are. The 3D printing of these scales is intriguing. IT appears that engineers, rather than tailors, may soon be backstage at fashion displays. What comes next is a captivating form of entertainment that appeals to those with a youthful spirit. It was a $2,900 robot. You could invest an extra $1,600 in a sophisticated electric vehicle, yet it won't possess the capabilities of jumping, moonwalking, or joystick control like this robot does. Additionally, you can use the robot if you're looking for a change. A single charge lasts 3 to 4 hours, and it can transport up to 80 kilograms of freight. What is the market size for wind energy? Indeed, 16 states in the U.S. alone rely on wind energy to meet 10% of their energy needs, and there remains ample opportunity for further exploration. This Spanish concept stands out due to its floating design, which allows for easy scaling up. With the goal of achieving 15 megawatts from a turbine, they are currently evaluating the prototype and determining the capacity of the upcoming, fully completed versions. The initiative has already collaborated with Intech C, a business associated with the Iran Oman gas pipeline project and obtained millions of dollars in EU funding. Experts from the WHO estimate that cardiovascular illnesses account for about 16% of all fatalities globally. New scientific discoveries are saving more lives every day, which is good news.
These 3D printed models of actual hearts are one example of such a breakthrough. Tubes, sleeves, and valves make up the inside of these copies, while elastic ink coats the exterior, they are the perfect means of testing various treatments on patients, such as determining whether the heart's weaker areas can tolerate them. The best part is that creating and printing the model only takes a day, making these replicas extremely beneficial for training future medical professionals. We secretly long to overcome the constraints of nature, venture farther into the woods, scale taller mountains, and test the previously unheard of speed limits. Let's say the exoskeleton's designers. Although it costs a reasonable $300, it doesn't exactly resemble Tony Stark's outfit. This exoskeleton can compensate for up to 30 kilograms of weight and travel 25 kilometers on a single charge, allowing you to work more productively, travel farther, and feel less tired. It can even propel you up to 20 kilometers per hour. The exoskeleton has sufficient power to eliminate bothersome hikers, yet it lacks the ability to outrun a bear. The exoskeleton weighs 2.4 kilograms when two batteries are included. Here's another intriguing gadget. This system harnesses the power of waves to generate electricity. The idea is simple. Pressure changes in the membrane cause air to move, thereby turning the turbine, and the results are obvious. A 40 converter installation generated 60 megawatts of power during tests in Portugal. The European Regional Development Fund funded Europe Wave Program, which focuses on wave energy, has already invited the team, suggesting that the authorities share their sentiments. With all this energy, what can we do? Charging the 16.5 million electric vehicles that were on the road worldwide in 2021 is one possibility. With the right infrastructure, we could also produce many more automobiles. Installing a sufficient number of these stations is crucial. Because it's quicker and less expensive than waiting for a full charge, the idea is to replace a low battery with a new one. Everything will be ready in roughly 10 minutes, and in just a few weeks, a city can have a network of stations. The best part is that these stations are small and completely automated. One station takes up only two parking spots. It's beneficial to begin operations immediately. Plans include spending $39 billion to establish the station in the United States alone. Have you ever seen footsteps that didn't appear to belong there? The owner of these unusual shoes or Bigfoot may have left them behind. A German designer created this footwear, drawing inspiration from modern mythological creatures known as cryptids and 3D printing .tpe polymer, which is also frequently used for toothbrush handle soft pads and smartphone covers, serves as the primary component. The fact that it is a thin yet sturdy component of these shoes is one of their benefits. They are resistant to scorching sun and rain, even though they are only a millimeter thick. The designer selected the Centratec S2 SLS printer, which Daimler uses to manufacture replacement components to make these shoes. By 2040, Japan may have a labor deficit of more than 11 million workers. We are introducing railroad robots as a proactive solution to this problem, potentially leading to a 30% reduction in staff size. Using virtual reality glasses, the remaining employees will control the robots from specialized cabins while immediately viewing their duties on their supervisors' PCs. These robots will be useful for a variety of jobs, including wire work, sign replacement, and traffic light repair.